Fox Carolina Weather. Weather rate certified most accurate local forecast. Later on today, some of us could get caught in a thunderstorm. We have a severe weather threat for today. Even though it's a lower end risk, it's still elevated. So we are going to have to watch out for the potential of some strong gusty winds, cloud ground lightning. Even a brief tornado cannot be ruled out. So all of us here across the Carolinas under a marginal risk for strong to severe storms. All thanks to an area of low pressure. The same system that we've been monitoring for the past few days. That slow moving system is now getting closer into our region and you can see Kentucky and Tennessee right now getting a good little round of rain and thunderstorm activity already some severe storms popped up with that line and we are going to continue to see those clouds increasing for the morning but by the afternoon that's when we're we're going to have to be on guard for any of these storms that do flare up to go strong to severe right now it's just a few sprinkles that's going to be the case as we head into the early afternoon period but starting at a 4 p.m. that's when we are going to have to start to watch that line approaching our western sections of our viewing area, including northeast Georgia. Here's a look at 10 p.m. when a lot of us are getting to bed, maybe already sleeping at this point. You need to have your NOAA weather radio ready to go in case any warnings do get flared up for your area and just have a way to get multiple alerts like downloading our Fox Carolina news app. So here's a look at 10 p.m. Anywhere from the heart of the upstate and the mountains could be getting in on some of those heavy rain showers plus you can see some purple lining up here. That's indications of some possible hail from this system. So these computer models are throwing out some stronger storms and it will start to taper off by midnight and then into your Friday. It's going to be a lower chance of some rain and storm development, but we are going to be looking at some showers likely early next week once again. So it's just going to be these rounds and rounds of rain as well as some storms. It's just this unsettled weather pattern that we're in. So here Here's like the storm timing for today, 4 p.m. to 7 p.m. Northeast Georgia, Franklin, you're included in that. Places like Asheville, Greenville, Anderson, 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. is your time frame. And then 10 p.m. to about midnight. That's for places in Cherokee County down stretching towards Newberry. So Union and Lawrence County, you're included in that as well. So here's a look at Futurecast rainfall totals. How much rain are we going to get out of this? We definitely need some. We haven't seen some significant rainfall in the past few days. Well, anywhere from about a half an inch or less looks likely at this point. Today for the upstate, 81 degrees. The winds will be out of the southwest at 5 to 15 miles per hour, monitoring those storms throughout the afternoon and evening. Same thing for the mountains, just a little bit cooler, similar to yesterday's temperature, 76 degrees. And here's a look at your seven day forecast. We will continue to have the, that heat building for the weekend. Temperatures will be in the upper 70s. 80s. We'll hold on to the 70s for the mountains for these next few days. 80s returning for Saturday and Sunday, and then those 80s will hold early next week. But look at next week, another chance of rain and some storms.